Oh, look at that. 185, uh, 180 horsepower engine. And for those that know about G-Force, can go up to 6G and down to minus 3G. It's actually a, a plastic aircraft, it's uh, carbon fibre. It's made by Grob in Germany, we've got about 123 of them in the military. So any pilots in the military you see flying anything else will have trained on this aircraft. It's the first one they fly on. They, uh, the student pilots will do about 56 hours flying this before they move on to the next stage of training. And um, both the display pilot and myself, it's our day job to train the next generation of RAF pilots. And also pilots from overseas. So a bit about the display pilot himself, his name's Flight Lieutenant Andy Brees. Look at he is. He joined the Air Force in 1991 as a navigator. Wow. He uh, went on to be a navigator on the Tornado. But then, uh, then decided to cross over and become a pilot. Flew the, uh, flew the Tornado as a pilot. He also flew the Harrier, for those that know the Harrier. Um, and the Hawk, Takano, Domini, and now he's flying the Tutor. So this aircraft, the Tutor, is actually, uh, as well as all military pilots, is flown by air cadets and also university air squadron um, students. So um, if you're an air cadet or thinking about joining the air cadets, you'll uh, get the chance to fly this, this aircraft every year. We're based out of Cranwell in Lincolnshire and um, Andy and myself brought two of these aeroplanes down to Cardiff this afternoon and, uh, and trust me, we've flown across the whole country and you've got easily the best weather compared to the rest of the country. It's horrible all the way down. Um, or, sorry, as with all military training aircraft, whilst uh, operated by military pilots, they're actually uh, owned and maintained by a, a civilian company. So, so this aircraft is owned and maintained by Babcock. Babcock uh, engineers uh, with us as part of the team, and uh, they look after this uh, aircraft and make sure it's uh, ready for us to fly. This next manoeuvre he's positioning for now is, uh, is a very difficult one for, for any pilot out there to fly. He's actually going to roll the aeroplane towards you, but actually be turning away. So he's actually turning up. Well, it's upside down. You can see straight into the cockpit there. goes diving back down over the pier, positioning for a manoeuvre known as a slow roll. So we'll start from inverted, then roll really slowly back to inverted. Okay, we're getting towards the end now. Andy's uh, positioning for one of his final runs. 
He's going to be diving back down, all the way down to 100 feet. He's going to be going at over 200 miles an hour. As he comes past, he will be able to see you, and he will be waving, so he wants you to wave back. So ladies and gentlemen, the Royal Air Force 2014 Shooter Display Pilot, Flight Lieutenant Andy Priest. Oh,